Sun. The only <laughs> day we have a, a little bit of cloud cover. It looks like Sunday. Okay. Uh, slight chance of some showers there. We're going to see that on future cast here in just a moment. Uh, but for much of this Memorial Day weekend, uh, a lot going on and some great weather to enjoy it as well. And we've been enjoying this long spell of uh, really nice and dry weather for quite some time. Uh, Strawberry Festival Festival in Borden, Indiana, Saturday racing Louisville FC as well Saturday. And as Alden mentioned, Abbey Road on on the river all the way through Memorial Day and we've got the mayor's hike bike and paddle Memorial Day morning too and wild lights at the zoo still going on as well 78 Saturday 72 on Sunday with the extra clouds slight chance of a couple light rain showers on Sunday those temperatures will be just a tad bit cooler a 76 are high officially today four off the normal high of 80 for this time of the year 94 the record back in 1911 it did start off just a tad bit on the cool side in the upper 50s it is just a little breezy too. every once in a while the camera uh, kind of going up and down a little bit Belmont Village cam looking over the city skyline here with a sunny sky and our U of L health camera network uh, lower to mid 70s throughout the area with that wind gust at around 20 to 23 miles per hour and the humidity nice and low at 31%. And that's the key here throughout the weekend with that northeast breeze, the humidity levels will be on the low side. So nothing muggy anytime soon. Mostly lower 70s out there. You can crack open the windows, uh, enjoy that fresh air. 72 in Brandenburg, 74 in Lebanon. Crack open the windows if the pollen doesn't bother you. We've got some grass pollen around the area right now. Humidity tracker forecast low level, super low through the weekend. And so really just some clean, refreshing air for us. And then the mugginess goes up a little bit by the middle of next week. As we start to see the increase in humidity, that comes along with temperatures approaching 90 degrees by the middle of next week. And that is typical for this time of the year. Usually June 1st is our first 90, and that's our forecast high for June 1st as well. Over the Ohio Valley, a sunny sky, really not much happening. And the reason for that is high pressure, the dominant weather feature. That is an area of air that is sinking and is really stable and really blocks out the rain. So northeastern United States, southeastern United States, and over the, over the Great Plains and Rockies, there's some active weather with some showers. But right here in the middle from the Great Lakes down to the deep south, it is pretty much all dry. So future cast, as you can imagine, pretty quiet. Temperatures in the 60s uh, as we head towards sunset. Overnight low temperatures in the 40s to around 50 degrees. So maybe just a tad bit chilly right around sunrise, but then a bit warmer for tomorrow afternoon as we make it up to the upper 70s for tomorrow. A northeast flow continues into Saturday. That keeps our temperatures uh, at or just a little bit below normal in the upper 70s and mostly sunny for Saturday afternoon. Notice the change here on Sunday. We start to see clouds increasing and we have a system moving in from the opposite direction from the southeast. Typically, of course, our weather comes in from the west, but it looks like areas along and east of I-65 have the best chance for a few rain showers from time to time on Sunday. I don't think it's going to be a big bother, but might need the umbrella a little bit uh, for Sunday. Cool and clear. Your forecast tonight low down to 52. That's a city low. Suburbs outlying areas in the 40s. Mostly sunny tomorrow and just a tad bit warmer with our high of 78. Keeping in mind our normal high is 80. We're going to be uh, a little bit below that through the weekend, except for Memorial Day Monday, back up to around 82 degrees. And then we start to pump in that warmer air and a little bit muggier as well. 88 for our last day of May on Wednesday. June 1st begins with a high near 90 degrees with a few pop-up storms possible.